Hi, Cheryl Locke here for HotBlogTips.com and in this video we're going to go through the basic settings for your Google Plus Hangouts and Hangouts on Air. We'll start up in the top right corner. The first button in the far right corner is your telephone. This is your exit button. When you're ready to leave your Hangout or Hangouts on Air, simply click this and you will exit. Next is your settings. It looks like a little gear. When you click this, a new box will open. This is where you can choose which camera you want your Hangout or Hangouts on Air to pick up from, which microphone you will be picking up, and how will you be listening to your Hangout or Hangouts on Air. Headphones, speakers, what have you, should be listed here and choose the correct one. Come down and click Save Settings. This should save a lot of trouble Next is your little bars. This is where you can adjust the bandwidth. If you need to lower the bandwidth that you're using, you can use this little slider bar to do it. Keep in mind, when you lower the bandwidth, you will possibly lose the image or the image from cameras will be degraded. Then we have turn camera off. When we click this, you will simply Turn your camera off. Your little avatar at the bottom is no longer your live cam. It is now just your Google Plus avatar. So if you need to exit your area for a minute, what have you, you can turn this on so no one sees what's going on. Or maybe you need to pick your nose. When you get ready to come back live, click the button. And as you can see, you're back to your live cam. Next is a very important button. This is your mute button. This mutes your microphone. Sometimes it will automatically come on if you're typing. So if you see it go red, you've been muted. Also an administrator of the room can mute you. I suggest you get comfortable with this button. When you click it, it will be red. You are muted. This means that there will be no background noise, be it the kids, the TV, the dogs, the phone, your air conditioner, what have you. You may not think your background noise is very much, but when you get 10 people in a room, all the background noise can add up and no one can hear anything. So learn to mute your microphone when you get ready to say something. Just simply unclick it and everyone can hear you again. That leads us to these five dots. These five little dots are telling me that yes, my microphone is being picked up. I can see it move as I speak, so I know my microphone is working. So these are your basic settings for Google Plus Hangouts or Hangouts on Air. We hope this short video has helped you become a little more comfortable using Google Plus Hangouts and Hangouts on Air. Please be sure to subscribe to Hot Blog Tips here on YouTube for more helpful videos. Thank you.